Starting up on today's video is the Sherp ATV. Designed for rough and soggy terrains, Sherp is a Ukrainian company headquartered in Kyiv. The key feature of this vehicle is its large wheels with an onboard system to inflate or deflate them, which allows vehicles to travel through water, cross brushwood, and climb up thin ice. The Sherp is absolutely affordable if you consider the full range of features that it comes with. For just $50,000, you can get your hands on one of the largest all-terrain vehicle in the world. There is nothing this vehicle can't drive over. It was designed to plow through ice, water, and snow. You could also take it through the desert, and it will still handle well. The car has a top speed of 27 miles per hour on land and 4 miles per hour on water. The car is able to run on water because there is a device that automatically drains water from the body of the vehicle. Number 8. The American Dream Ranked as the longest car in the world, this crazy limo has a length of 100 feet. It was first built in California in 1986 and originally measured 60 feet rolled on 26 wheels with a pair of V8 engines in the front and back. To put its immense size into perspective, most cars measure between 12 to 16 feet. In fact, you could park 12 smart for two cars in a single file line, and the American dream would still be longer than all of them. This record-breaking limo can be driven from both ends and can also operate as a rigid vehicle. The car was built in two sections and joined in the middle by a hinge for turning tight corners. Inside the American dream includes material pleasures fit for a king, its large size and extravagant features allows passengers to ride in the lap of luxury. Next on our list is the Burlak. Often described as the best Russian truck in the universe, this six-wheel amphibious truck is a sight to behold. The car can go just about anywhere, and Russia was testing it to carry 10 researchers to the North Pole. This 7-meter armored truck weighs 3 tons, and it comes with all the amenities needed, including a fully stocked kitchen, shower, and a toilet which are all necessary to survive in the North Pole. Being a snow and swamp vehicle, it is equipped with 32-inch wheels on low-pressure tires that are suitable for difficult terrain and water sports. According to reports, there are propellers which enable the truck to float on water. This Russian truck has not been declared a production vehicle, and it would be difficult to estimate how much it would cost if the producer decide to sell it directly to consumers. Number 6. The Belaz 75710 an ultra-class haul truck manufactured in Belarus by Belaz. In 2013, it was the world's largest and highest capacity haul truck. It has four-wheel drive and four-wheel hydraulic steering, which is unusual for a truck of this magnitude. It has a conventional two-axle setup, but the wheels are doubled, one to an axle, imitating the 1950s International Pay Hauler 350. Ranked as one of the largest land vehicles in the world, the Belazi is 20.6 meters long, 8.16 meters high, and 9.87 meters wide. This huge truck has a turning radius of about 102 feet and can carry up to 450 metric tons. Unlike most vehicles in its class, the truck comes with two engines, which can each produce up to 2300 horsepower with a top speed of 40 kilometers per hour when fully loaded. Taking the fifth spot is the Terex RH400, said to be one of the world's largest mining vehicles. This vehicle is found in many mining areas across the world. According to reports, the RH400 has a maximum power of 3,360 kW and can manage up to 50 cubic meters bucket capacity. Ranked as one of the largest land vehicles in the world, the RH400 is popular in pop culture. It made an appearance in the second Transformers film playing the role, Deception Demolisher. In terms of displacement, the RH400 has a 69-liter 16-cylinder engine, which produces up to 4,500 horsepower. It weighs over 2.1 million pounds and has a fuel capacity of 4,226 gallons, which makes it a beast when it comes to mining. The maximum travel speed is 1.4 miles per hour, which is understandable given the weight of the vehicle. Next on today's video is the Caterpillar 797F, a series of off-highway mechanical powertrain haul trucks developed and manufactured in the United States. The 797 is made specifically for high production mining and heavy construction applications. This Caterpillar has been in production since 1998. The 797 series represents Caterpillar's largest and highest capacity haul trucks. The current third-generation model, the 797F, 
offers one of the largest haul truck payload capacities in the world. Following the footsteps of its mammoth predecessor, the Caterpillar 797F has a payload capacity of up to 345 tons, which is the highest payload capacity among mechanical drive haul trucks. Additionally, the 797F is more powerful, and it also comes with a more efficient engine. At the third spot is the Liebherr T282B. Established in 1949, Liebherr is a German-Swiss multinational equipment manufacturer based in Switzerland, with its main production facilities and origins in Germany. This monstrous off-highway and ultra-class haul dump truck is used primarily in gold, coal, copper, and iron mining operations. With a height of 7,620 meters and a payload capacity of 363 tons, the Liebherr T282B is one of the largest capacity dump truck in the world. This gigantic vehicle features a 20-cylinder diesel engine that produces 3,750 horsepower and can reach a maximum speed of 64 kilometers per hour. The T282B's standard features included air suspension seats, double shell concept for safety, and emergency engine shutdown. Number 2. The NASA Crawler. As the name suggests, this vehicle is used to transport spaceships from the assembly point to the launch area. According to Wikipedia, the vehicle was originally used to transport the Apollo, Saturn V, and Skylab rockets. Ranked as one of the largest land vehicle in the world, the transporter is said to have cost NASA around $14 million. The crawler weighs 2,721 tons and has four pairs of tracks located on either end. The vehicle pumps out over 2,750 horsepower and it runs on two 750 kilowatt hour generators. According to Wikipedia, the NASA Crawler Transporter was the largest self-powered vehicle in the world when it was completed. At the top spot on today's countdown is the Bagger 288. The Bagger 288 was built by the German company Krupp. For the energy and mining firm Rheinbraun, it is a bucket wheel excavator or mobile strip mining machine. It took five years to design and manufacture, and five years to assemble, with a total cost reaching $100 million making it not only the largest land vehicle in the world, but also one of the world's most expensive mining equipment. According to Wikipedia, the Bagger 288 weighs 13,500 tons, and the machine can excavate up to 240,000 tons of coal daily. In terms of size, the Bagger 288 is up to 220 m long. Additionally, this massive vehicle requires 17 megawatts of power to operate at its optimum capacity.